What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a great day and thank you for watching this video. So let's get started. This is Luis from Motor Films. This week was a bad week for some Aussie who crashed an ultra rare Ferrari F40. Although not the rarest supercar, 1315 F40s were made to mark the 40th anniversary of Ferrari, hence the 40. But on Friday, July the 17th, one of these bees had an accident. Luckily, nobody was injured, but the story is a bit interesting. In Queensland, Australia, the owner of this F40 took the car out for a spin after not driving it for five years, according to local news. Legend has it the owners of these F40s only drive them every couple of years. You know what? Which is typical for these owners. Police say that speeding and you know the lack of driving this car for five years contributed to this crash. Two people were in the car but luckily nobody was injured. The car also took out some poles before going off road and landing near a tree. There are several Ferrari F40s for sale and almost all of them sell for a 2 million or more. The owner was actually in the process of selling this car which is probably why he was enjoying it one last time. Some speculate that it was a test drive since it had dealer plates but these cars tend to always keep dealer plates with them and also it was later clarified that this was not a test drive and the actual owner was driving the car. What makes this worse is that since he was selling the car supposedly a rumor spreading around says the F40 was not insured. By looking at the pictures you can see extensive damage done to this car and fixing it is not going to be cheap. The driver also was giving a citation for losing control of the car which is part of Australian law. Some mechanic which specializes in F40s mentioned on a post that repairing this F40 would cost north of $1 million. According to other rumors and yes I know these are just rumors on the internet which you have to take with a grain of salt. This was an F40 replica, hence the no insurance. So guys, what do you guys think? Is this an F40 replica? Um, do you think the owner could actually fix this? Is it even worth fixing this car or just giving it out for auction to see if Tavarish will fix it or something? Let me know down in the comment section and thank you guys so much for watching my video. Hope you have a great rest, great rest of your day or night and peace out guys.